Hello everybody, welcome back to Padfoot TD Games. My name is Zach, I'm the voice behind the icon, and today we are back in Planet Coaster once again with Riverside Park, and we are getting ready for Christmas. So I said last episode we were going to do one more of getting ready, and I do apologize if you're getting completely bored with that. And again, if you don't, guarantee next week will be even better. So, source custom tag. Okay, so we don't have anything pre-built like a gingerbread house. Because that'd be handy if we did. Oh, wait, we might. Because, <coughs> <coughs> excuse me. Um, hmm. Ginger, yeah. Bread. <laughs> nope. All right, well, off we go, I guess. We are going to make some houses. That's the next thing I want to do. I was hoping maybe they had a pre-built house. You're going to make me build it on a grid, aren't you? Well, gingerbread houses, here we come. Just want some, like, little itty-bitty ones. Put that back down on the ground, young man. That's going to be in a tree. Ow, 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 ow. We'll ignore that. That's it. we'll just ignore the casters and that. That should be fine, right? All right. So we've gotten that. Let's put on. Oh, so many moving options. That's pretty. Okay. Stop looking at the trees. Let's get this going here. That's a big slope. These people don't live in luxury. They live in bread. They don't. They live. They live in a cookie. All right. So we've got those. I'm just trying to like speed build some of these. You know, it's that last kind of bit that I want to get in here before we can start building more onto our park. Um, I did have somebody ask me, it was very interesting, um, why do I like Christmas decorations so much? Um, or decorating so much? And, you know, why would I dedicate so many episodes to doing it? Well, first and foremost, um, the, this channel is doing things that I like to do. I would already be doing this anyway, so I just figured I would share them with you. You, you all, I should say. And uh, seeing as we have 54 subscribers as of right now, I think we're doing something right. This isn't for everybody, and I 100% understand that. Oh my god, chimney. I 100% understand that. And if you don't like it, that's fine. But, first and foremost, it's, uh, it's what I want to do. Secondly, that's a giant chimney for this little house, but whatever. Um, it brings happiness and joy. Really, if it comes down to it, that that's that's the big reason: is happiness and joy. Because <clears throat> I'm all I'm all about that. I work in the world of entertainment for a reason. I like to bring happiness and joy. Um, and I guess I'm working on the weight of Santa, so you know I got that going for. Me. Really, that's the way you want to rotate? Oh my god. Okay. Turn. Let's turn you a little bit. That way. Okay, now. I know you're just a visual thing, but you're being a pain in the ass. Okay, let's see. Creep. So now, shouldn't I be able to? I can kind of cheat here, right? So I've gotten that angle I already like. If I lift you up. Can I turn you into a window? Yes, I can. Cheating. Let's see, do we have like the generic, generic gingerbread window? Nope. Put it right back against that gingerbread. <laughs> <coughs> Excuse me, now I'm dying. Well, I had it coming, I guess. Let's see, that looks a little too realistic. He's being jaggy every once in a while. Oh, wrong buttons if you can't tell. Welcome everybody. I wish all everybody could, I wish we be selling hats, like festive hats. I wonder if I can. Now that I'm actually thinking about it, I think I can. I'll to self check here in a moment. Get that standing up right ish. Okay. There. A 
little bit more. There we go. Control X and bring you this way. <coughs> Excuse me. Let's see. So we've got a lot of like archways and snow. Weird snow. Right, Digging that gingerbread house for now. Okay, it's gonna be like Candy Lane. Candy Land. Maybe it'll be Candy Land. I don't know. Is that copy is that copywritten? The world may never know. Let's go here. Let's see. Con it's just some content packs. Do I did I buy World's Fair? Yeah, it did. No, I haven't yet. I swear it sounded like trust me, I'm an engineer. I know that's what my brain wanted to hear. But that is definitely what I wanted to hear. Can we fit a large tree in here? Make this festive as balls. Like it. We need more light in here. That's something I'm learning right now. <coughs> Excuse me. Oh man, they get bigger. Okay. Alright, so we're definitely gonna need some sort of festive lighting. Gotta start pondering that right now, but... Oh, look at you're so tiny. Oh, this is gonna be tedious, but I'm about to do something, guys. I'm just gonna have to demolish this whole area afterwards. <laughs> Strike it all. Tear it all down. But I like this. I like where these are going. Trying my best to get everyone into the middle. So it doesn't help that there's no light. So anytime it wants to go to daytime, it's good by me. Turn, turn a little bit. There we go. There. Ah, thank you, daylight. Just helping me get these along. And this is only one path. Oh, good. You're actually all going to be on a building. Okay, that's the one time where I'm actually excited that I grouped everything together. Up a little bit. Weird emo teenager who's definitely a Slytherin. Welcome to the park. Spend money. <laughs> that's going to be our motto now. We're just going to put that outside. Welcome. Spend your money. Oh, it's a good time. But I think by the time this comes out, we are pretty far into December. And again, I, I'm filming things in advance just because of my work schedule. So uh, I do apologize if you're seeing this and you're like, oh, well, bored. <laughs> or not even close. And you're like, oh, he's just putting down candy canes. Well, yes, somebody has to. And why not me and Ella? Hi, Ella. Dad, shut up. I'm sleeping. You need to go back to your candy canes. Well, yes, ma'am. That is what I'm going to do right now. Let's turn you a little bit. We spent a whole episode putting down walls for a go-kart track. Now, here's the thing. That's semi-permanent because we like that ride. This is not. Also, still hoping for mini golf. It's the one thing that hasn't come over yet from Plan uh, to Plan Co. from uh, Roller Coaster Tycoon is having that. I'd also like a maze... I can make a whole list, <laughs> to be honest. I could definitely make a whole list of things that I, I want. But what's nice is with the content creator coming, I think a lot of our prayers are going to be answered. We're going to be showing a lot of stuff that is not us made. I, I still want us to try, but there's just custom objects I can't make. I'm going to turn you. Come on, that way. How do you look? looking beautiful I wish I could just paint part of the ground snowy I bet you I probably can and I just haven't even looked yet <coughs> excuse me pardon me but yeah let's see what else is going on in our world let's see we um oh I guess kind of another biggie I talked about you know my dad job situation and right now it looks like it's gonna be good and they got bought so that makes us really happy um, mom, mom's working from home still for her company, which is really cool. She doesn't, 
own the company, but the company she is working for allows her to work from home. So that's cool. Danielle might be working full time. Uh, I'm at my point of my review right now. Uh, everything has gone super smooth thus far with my review process. The person who watched my class said that he really enjoyed it and uh, only gave me two things to work on, which is actually really good as a teacher because my first year, of course, I was brand new to everything. Uh, there was a lot. There's a lot that they said I could have worked on, and it's really nice to know that I'm making progress. So that means the world to me. You have a spot for an umbrella. You're underneath the shade, though. Like our little pine grove here for Riverside. Come into the shade and chill out. But, oh my god, we're only like halfway there. <laughs> I guess we're getting closer. Okay. Don't complain. Just keep working. Just keep putting your peppermint down. Here's the problem. I know it's so tedious, and I know, especially you as a viewer, especially if I get so focused, I stop doing commentary, which happens a lot, and I understand that, and I apologize for that. Um, it looks so good afterwards, though. The problem is, is I don't come in here and take my off time and build Riverside. There is a universal park that I think on my December break, I think I'm gonna come in and start playing around with. I'm gonna look at copyright terms, etc., and see if maybe I can maybe do a video or two on that, but it will not be as much as our Riverside. I'm not losing any sort of creativity. The problem is, is uh, a lot of people that I see that play this game uh, do it in time-lapse form, and I know how to do that. But I, I don't have time to play, time lapse it, and then do the voiceover. I have time enough to sit and play, and I think that's I think that's what my channel I feel is about. You know, there's some people that might come here for me to talk. It might be for the games that they just can't play on their computer yet, or some of the random games that we end up somehow finding and you know trying to bring back to life. <coughs> I have a pretty big steam library and right now i'm just doing the games that i know that i can sit and record a buttload of um to be able to make up for time but i really want to get back to you know taking my time and, and trying different things like you know try skyscraper simulator again i i, I love that game because i like what it's trying you know keep keep playing that i know that's gonna take some time there's a whole bunch of uh, bitch. Why? Yeah, thank you. That's why the candy cane's there. But this is, um... Yeah, this is what we're all about, but I, I want to bring a little bit more variety, because right now it's been what feels like the same games. Not necessarily over and over, but... Just kind of working all together. Also, the last thing that I had filmed in this last recording session, not this one, obviously, um, and the last time I got to sit down was a beam NG. It's like part three, I think. And you'll notice that I'm very kind of hectic in there and the video is super short. Um, that's because I got an email saying, you know, I'm, I'm almost over budget for computer program. You know, I bought a computer and they're like, you should have gone through IT. These are all things that I didn't know. I didn't even got a budget until this year. Cause nobody had ever told me. And you know, I got all worried cause I'm a warrior. And then I, I looked at our numbers, I looked at what we spent, and I looked at, you know, our income and the money I had left of what she was telling me, and I was like, oh, this is going to be fine. We're going to be fine for the rest of the semester, you know, because we're one of the only programs that has to make money for our program to run. So that's why we charge money for tickets. Now, we don't make a lot, but it helps replenish, which is pretty awesome. So, had a quick scare, that's why that video... Holy shit, did we do them all? Oh my god, we did it. It doesn't look like a lot, but we did it. Holy shit. Done. Will you tell me how many pieces you are? It's included in the tree and everything. It's 191 objects. Oh, man. All right, cool. Well, we got all that in. Let's see, what else can we add here? So, small, medium? What are the mediums like? I'm going to just populate the forest with some it's a candy cane forest. And a lot of people are going to 
just if you're walking through, you'll be like, cool, there's just a whole bunch of candy canes in the woods. Pretty much. <laughs> it's about to go nighttime, too. See how much we've already been working on this? Holy crap. Also, let's see, what else in recent news? Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> this is something that's going to be old fact by the time you see it, but um, today is actually when Stan Lee passed away. Um, which is heartbreaking. And I was thinking about it a lot. You know, uh, it's not necessarily, oh, we, we lost the, the, the Marvel creator or the comic book guy. Or, or, you know, we lost somebody whose creativity um, has sparked millions in being creative. Um... You know, millions might be an oversight. It might be thousands of people have been inspired by Stanley, but um, everything that he's been able to create and just the creativity that he has is is now gone. You know, it, it, it lives on in the heart of anybody who's going to be creative and was inspired by him, and that's what I'm trying to remember. Like, I'm sad that he's no longer with us and, you know, we'll miss his cameos and everything, but um, his inspiration to creativity in the world of... Um, Art is just can't be touched by anybody, and that that's something that can never be taken away. Even though uh, a lot of public school systems are trying very, very desperately to make that all go away. <coughs> this comes from somebody whose uh, band program got cut when I was in high school, and I ended up teaching elementary schoolers band because they realized that they had completely fucked up. <laughs> um, so that's actually how I started teaching. Is that so? I'm just trying to put candy everywhere. Oh my god, these are huge. I don't know what this is, but it looks delicious. Jar and peppermint, and then we got gumdrops and everything too. That's in that tree. Oh well. Jammy biscuit. <laughs> oh, it's a jelly bean. Some of these are just massive. And I know that's the problem with Plan Co. Is, is the scale of everything. That kid's having a good time. Is that licorice? No, it's just sugar. Just straight sugar. It's just so big, and I, and I love it, but it also makes it kind of hard to put them somewhere sometimes. Is that a macaroon? Never had one. Yep. Never had a macaroon. I feel like this year's the year. This is the year that I'm going to try Planet Coaster cookie. Oh, I love it, but... Now, let's see. Do, 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 do. do we have anything else? We got presents that we could probably scatter around the park. We got gingerbread people. Of course we need people. Gingerbread Santa. Oh, the, you're standing up. That's actually very convenient. Thank you for doing that. Gingerbread trees. Oh, uh, this place is going to take so long to clear out. Oh, you're a table? Exqueeze you? What? <laughs> I'm putting that there. Somebody better sit at that goddamn table. Oh, you know what I should probably do? I know what I should probably do. Oh, there's a peppermint there. That's weird. There's that. There's that. <coughs> well, we need light in here. That's that's a given. But we're gonna we're actually gonna replace everything in here to make it completely holidayed. And it's a candy forest after all. I'm trying to make it match the part a little bit more. Let's come through and. Get rid of these. We will bring them back. We're just going to store them out back for now. It's interesting. I had I was, had a conversation with somebody the other day. I don't know where I was going. Um, it was a suggestion that with some of the major changes, 
A lot of theme parks do things at night, like right before that day cycle. That's maybe when we should do a lot of our changes if we're going for a little bit of different realism that I haven't seen before. Now granted, there's probably some... Sorry, lady. <laughs> um, I just think that that's, that's something different. I haven't seen that before, and I like that idea. Get rid of the old bins. <coughs> This one, this one, making it complete candy land. Candy forest, sorry. <laughs> Just waiting, like, YouTube come, like, crashing down. Can't use that. I doubt that path, but you never know. It's a weird world we live in. We all know that, right? Like these don't fit as well. Oh, it's probably because I have people walking around. Yeah, you feel like you need to be further away from the side. I didn't count how many were in here beforehand, but come on, there we are. Other things that are new. I want to buy a horse. Boom. Throwing out the random there. Uh, actually, I've been thinking about it a lot more recently than any other time, but for pretty much forever, I've always wanted a horse. Um, for riding, of course. I, I, I like that idea of that a little bit of freedom, and right now I know definitely partially influenced by Red Dead Redemption. Um, but I, I know what takes to take care of one, etc. It's just, you know, it's funds and timing and life. But I, I, you know, it is on my thoughts. It is on my horizon. So not sure where that'll go. Could it just stay right here in this conversation <coughs> that we're having? Um, and I'm still figuring out my life, but it's something that I'm thinking about. You know, I know it's a lot of money, <coughs> but you never know. Might be worth it. Let's go here. Let's go to lights. Of course, you're not going to have any normal lights. Okay. Do we have anything that's Christmassy? Um, dragon lamp. Ooh, I like that. This is, this is super. This feels right. Wish it was a little bit more nighttime now. At every corner, I'm trying to put one for now. Just so people can see. Let's see, do I, do I have any? Let's see. As I say, maybe our ground pars. There's all that. Ooh. Let's do, let's do a cluster here, actually. Do a back and side light kind of feel. Yep, right on top. That's exactly actually where I wanted that to go. <coughs> Keep it up, boys. She's going to sing it about 800,000 more times. You're good. Look at that. I like it. Bringing at least a little bit to life. I actually wonder, does it look better from over here? Yeah. Just to get that house in there. I love it. Okay, well, I think there's actually one thing, last thing I want to add here. And that is the ability for it to snow. Let's see. What do we got? This is a flurry. Yeah, you hear, like, stuff there. Ooh, this is a good idea. Okay, stop it.
I know these are going to be showing, but this is such like a temp thing that you probably won't work as hard to hide it. <coughs> Snow doesn't even make it down to the ground, but at least you know it's happening. And that's going, and that makes me happy. Well, we've done it. It is officially Christmas here. I know we only decorated one ride. I just don't think we're going to have time to decorate them all. Maybe I'll do a little bit more off camera, but I definitely can't, uh, definitely can't guarantee it. But that's going to do it for this episode of Planet Coaster with Riverside, getting it ready for Christmas. And I know it's coming right around the corner. But that's going to do it for this one. If you enjoy what you saw, we do live stream on Twitch from time to time. And we are on Instagram. Those links are down there in the description below. Let us know down in the comments what you think. I always love to be able to have a conversation with you. As well, you got any ideas that you might want to see in Riverside, let us know. And we'll see what we can do about them. Hit that thumbs up if you want to show the support and you enjoyed this video. If you really want to show much more support, hit that subscribe button. Oh, no, the dipper broke down. Hit that subscribe button. Uh, just lets us know that we're doing something right. And it puts a smile on our face every day when we're able to see it and know that we have an audience that we are creating for. That's a lot of people leaving this ride. But with that, I thank you guys so much for coming out to this one. And we'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye. <laughs>